treated. This is the real deal, everybody. Rare, unusual, exclusive. This is the awesome golden sapphire. And um, when you see up close, you're gonna see, of course, the faceting. These are the colors that as we get into fall and winter, you're gonna love. From five to a massive 16 millimeter round, I have never, ever seen a sapphire like this. I do have earrings available and a stretch bracelet available for $78 and $63. Um, Jay, obviously there's been a lot of talk about this. It's been featured in a lot of uh, HSM promotional material. A lot of our hosts have been wearing this over the past two weeks. Golden Sapphire has arrived. Wow. I mean, what else is there to say? You know, um, <laughs> okay. So this material, it comes from Guinea. So it, it comes from Africa, not New Guinea, not the island above Australia. This comes from Guinea. Okay, get out your, your atlas and check it out, okay? Guinea, Guinea's not a real tourist spot or anything like that, right? Um, this, is a, this is actually in Guinea, believe it or not, it, it's part of the, the gem belt that runs through that region. Uh, we don't get a lot of materials. In fact, this is only the third material ever I've gotten out of Guinea that I've, that I've actually got. Um, as far as I'm aware, we have an exclusive on this material so far. This, um, we bought everything, we bought, okay, let's, we bought all the really high grade materials so far that's come out of this new deposit. Uh, this is a very recent mine find. Um, this is golden sapphire, it's natural. It's not heat treated, it's not radiated, it's not enhanced. Um, now, all those things, I'm not saying that that's bad. Um, you know, the enhancement processes on these are actually sometimes as expensive as the rough. And it would even make it look even better. But we try to keep it as natural as possible. If, if you look at this on Nadia, okay, look, okay, this is even a better shot. You know, picture's worth a thousand words, right? So I'll shut up. I mean, <laughs> you see that right there? Okay, this is a, you know, and, and, and our sapphire necklaces that we make are not little small dinky tchotchke necklaces. No. I mean, they're eight millimeter, 10 millimeter. I mean, they're nice size beads. This is by massive, far massive. the most, the largest care weight that I've ever done in a natural sapphire in my entire career. I've never done anything bigger than this. This is a, just massive, it's Mondo. And what, what's really amazing with this material is the natural color of it, that golden color of it, that right there is key. I mean, you, you, I've never, actually, even when you see Seth, and sapphires come in every color of the rainbow, okay? Um, but this is the first time I've ever actually seen this color. I've seen yellows. Mm -hmm. um, and I've seen chocolates, mm -hmm. like really like a uh, like a real, real dark, sure. dark, dark, almost a black, but I've never seen where it's actually this gold color. And that that's what intrigued me. And that's what got me going on this. And, um, you know, I haven't been in sapphires very long. Mm -hmm. um, this year would be four years since I've kind of got into the sapphire business. Mm -hmm. It's not that I wasn't aware, I've been doing it for 46 years. Right. It's not that I wasn't aware of Sapphire or I didn't see Sapphire in my travels. It's just, I didn't have the mining connections that I needed to actually get the deals um, that I needed to be able to do it. And also at, at the time when I first started seeing Sapphire, um, I didn't have the ability that we have now where I can buy huge bulk right. and make a lot, you know, big deals and where we can go in there and do a significant significant deal and the, um, you know be able to pay for it on the spot and because of HSN be able to hold it and be able to actually uh, work this material otherwise you would never ever see this to be honest with you I don't think it would ever come to America um, if anything if the material uh, you would see it maybe in Africa if you're in Africa you probably see it in Saudi Arabia yeah, um, you see it in Dubai, places mm -hmm. like that. But I, I don't think that this material actually would migrate to America. We are 10 minutes away, everyone. So if the phone is downstairs, upstairs, hidden down the side of the sofa, uh, if the cat's sleeping on it, make sure you go and grab it and be ready. Mm -hmm. The two pieces are coming up. 
Royal Blue Turquoise, the most expensive, exclusive ever. And that blue opal. Thank you for your orders on this one. We see you, the earrings are nearly gone, the bracelet is nearly gone. Stretch as you can see here. The earrings fabulously priced at 63. I can't imagine any of your friends will ever have even heard of golden sapphire, natural, untreated, truly a wonder and a miracle of nature. Thank you for your orders on 076219 and of course the matching necklace. Okay, nine minutes left. Every J. King fan needs to see what we will do at 10, 15 tonight. All right, let's keep going. Uh, we have a, a couple of quick ones. Oh yeah. Right, clearance, last of, last of uh, the quantity. We did a clearance item in the last hour. We're just gonna do this one real fast, get this sold out. It's our beautiful sterling silver ruby pendant necklace. Um, this is a necklace that could be a necklace by itself. You've got the ruby pendant, obviously gives you another look. Uh, I do have earrings available on clearance at 55. I have the ring available at $58. Um, we love our rubies. Jay, again, I'm not used to seeing ruby at this particular price. I love the design of this. I've presented this with you before, even at full price, it was exceedingly popular. Yeah, this is a contemporary cross design. Of course, the, uh, the pendant can be worn separately of the necklace. Um, this is a material from, um, from India. It's a natural ruby material. Um, we, uh, we, you know, I, I, you know, here again with ruby, Okay, <laughs> I've only, I've only, okay, I've been doing this for 46 years. I, I've been able to do Ruby three times. So Mauritius, as everybody knows, a lot of people got in on this. This is India. And then um, I had an African uh, Ruby one time before. So, you know, Ruby is not every day that you can do it. Now, can you buy Ruby? Absolutely. Look at the grade of this, okay? Especially the, the, the grade of the material that's actually in the, uh, the pendant, right? If you look at that, um, the, uh, the pendant, look at the grade of the ruby. Okay, look at the grade of the ruby in the ring. I mean, this is over the top. And this is one of the big three. So this is all precious uh, material. So uh, you've got sapphire, you've got emerald, mm -hmm. and then you've got ruby. Those okay. are the, the big three, right? And we launched that. This is, of those big three though, this was a brand new mine find that we just re recently did in Ruby. And this mater material is mined in India of all places. That in, just that in alone uh, makes it really rare. You don't, you know, I, I don't get a lot of materials out of India, to be honest with you. I, I get a lot of materials from India that I learn about in India because a lot of my friends they're, they're like me, they go out, they travel, they give me a call, they help me uh, do the deal at the mine, broker mm -hmm. the rough, and then they'll help me with the transport and all that from the area. And that's actually how I found this um, material, to be honest with you, it's a, a good friend of mine who turned me on to the mine. Ring available all the way up to size 12, but getting really limited at this stage. The earrings, as you can see here, so feminine, so elegant, that beautiful color, gorgeous shapes in there. And again, faceted really to give you that added extra sparkle. And then you've got the beautiful ruby necklace, which is the best seller of the three pieces. It is one of the big three. A lot of us, we talk diamonds naturally, but you gotta have emeralds and sapphires and rubies in there, that beautiful, rich July birthstone that is always gonna be on your wish list, on your must-have list. What's nice, as Jay said, remember, I can take that off and create a whole different look. Maybe you just wanna wear that ruby necklace as it is. Two minutes or sell out at the lowest price ever on HSN, so certainly grab it while you can. Jay, ultimately, you know, it's these types of pieces that garner a lot of new customers for us, for you, a lot of people that crave these beautiful must-have gemstones but find values that you just would never typically see in a store. That's part of your journey over these past 26 years, right, Jay? You kind of cut out so many different of the middlemen. Well, you know, actually I cut them all out. <laughs> 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 you know, we're a, for people who don't know what Mind Finds is, we're, we're, kind of a, we're kind of a very unusual niche, niche business. And I say that honestly, um, there are some of the people, I, I know a few people that are close to us, but I don't know anybody that really does exactly what right. we do. 
We go right to the mine, right to the source, whenever possible. The furthest I get away from is something that is cons a consolidator where I can't go in there or I can't be there, you know, every day to buy up the material. So that's as far away from the rough material that we get. We do all the, we go right to the mines, we buy the rough material. We do all the designing in-house. We do all the silver work with our trained silversmith from scratch in-house. We do all the lapidary work in-house and then we sell it directly here on the Mine Find Show. We don't sell it anywhere else. These are, designs aren't available anywhere else. You can't buy these designs anywhere else. It, they're exclusive just to the Mine Find Show and we make them only for here. You can't get any more direct than that, guys, okay? Um, normally, um, somebody like me, as the manufacturer, I manufacture, I sell it to a distributor who sells it to a wholesaler, uh -huh. who sells it to a retailer, right. okay? That's right. how it works. Okay, so there's none of that <laughs> going on. It's manufacturer, direct, <laughs> direct here on the Mind Find show. So that's it. I mean, there's only that leap. Um, so normally where I would sell to people who sell to people who sell to people, we're able to sell directly to you. And that's why people see these incredible values. And a lot of people always tell me, I, one of the common things that people tell me, they go, you know, the first time I bought from you, I thought, oh my gosh, for this price, no way. I mean, no way, it's just gonna look good. And then they get it home, they open it up, and they go, wow, that's incredible. And they're, uh, they're really enthusiastic, and usually then a lot of them become fans, and they become, you know, we have people that have shopped with us for 26 years. I so, I mean, that is probably the biggest compliment that anybody could have i know it's a you know we all take it as a compliment anyway and that's so why we I'm, have I'm really happy and we want everybody to be happy and, and bring joy and the cool thing with mind finds you can tune in you know you're always going to see new you're always going to see different you're going to see something you never even knew existed or never even thought about the adventure never ends and mr j king ring i have three dozen left before sell out if you want the earrings less than 40 and of course that amazing necklace congratulations if you are on the phone grabbing yours if you shop a lot with jay one of the best ways to shop is with the hsn charge card uh certainly apply today and save 40 dollars off a first single item purchase maybe that first item is going to be the mega stars of the show ladies and gentlemen we are moments away from a true happening here on the network. To celebrate Jay's 26 years, I have two pieces. They are extraordinary, each in their own right. One of them is amazing blue opal. This is something you would simply never, ever, ever see. It's a rarity, it's a scarcity. It's only been a part of Jay's life four times. We will make this available to celebrate Jay's journey. And then following that, we will offer the most expensive turquoise Jay has ever ever had in his collection royal blue turquoise from the mountains of chile we will offer this tonight not at a thousand dollars or hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars but we will offer it at the lowest price in home shopping network history a turquoise that every j king fan has to have will it be this one will it be that one will it be both of them stay with us get the phone by your side log on to hsn.com because the excitement is about to begin the big deals are revealed right after this. Want 15% off a future purchase? Then join HSN's email list. You'll receive a welcome coupon, plus so many special offers only for our email subscribers, like exclusive email-only invites to our private sales and events. Plus, you'll be first in line to shop our best values of the day and can't miss deals sent right to your inbox. And if you love coupons, you'll get them monthly, but only if you're on our list. So sign up today. Just keep an eye on your inbox, and we'll send all kinds of good things your way. Worry about one less thing with our Protection Plus plans at HSN. Electronics, fitness equipment, even jewelry can be covered. Shop smarts and protect your purchase. It's easy to add when you're checking out. Search Protection Plus at hsn.com for more details. There are so many reasons to shop HSN during our Brands You Love weekend. We're bringing our biggest names and brightest stars together just for you. Shop with us throughout the weekend for valuable deals you'll really love on HSN and at hsn.com. 26 years ago, the journey began on HSN. 1995 was the year. J. King revolutionized the way that we thought about gemstones and jewelry and how you find them. This first piece is something that would not normally ever be seen on Home Shopping Network. 
This is massive, giant, real, genuine blue opal. This piece of jewelry is a one and done. Once it's sold out, it is done, it is gone, it is retired. This was made and brought to HSN to celebrate Jay's extraordinary achievement of 26 years. This is something that really money cannot buy at any price, whether you're willing to spend thousands of dollars or hundreds of dollars. For every J. King fan that appreciates quality, style, design, rarity, scarcity, and of course a real mind find, blue opal is all of the above. When we reveal the pricing, it will not be $500 or $1,000. It will be significantly less than that. But you must start to order immediately. This is not on wait list. This is never scheduled to return. It comes in 18 inches, but it goes to around 21 inches. Folks, let's reveal it. Blue opal, real, everyone unique, everyone different, everyone special. It's not $500. It's $175 and change while supplies last. This is a monumental happening at HSN. This is part one. Royal Blue Turquoise is gonna be next. I'm gonna keep you abreast of how many are left, but we are already over 40% sold through of the quantity that we had available. So I encourage you, I encourage you to dial in. Sizing, just so you know, we're looking at a 32 by 27 millimeter, uh, 14 by 15 millimeter, the rondelles, four by two to seven by four. But that giant, giant piece at the bottom is a 32 by 27, free form piece, already 100 of folks ordering and dialing on in. The culmination of a 26 year journey is here and now with this. Jay, four times in your life and your career have you been able to bring Blue Opal. How special is this? Okay, so just so everybody knows, okay, you look at this, you've seen Blue Opal from me before what I've done, okay? This is out of my personal private stash that I was never gonna sell. Okay, I was never gonna sell this material. I sat on this. This is the best of the best of the best. This is the royal blue of this material that we got out of India, okay? I was never gonna let go of this. Um, somebody told me, okay, enough with this nonsense, and you, you, you gotta, you know, you need, to, you need to kick it over and give it up, okay? <laughs> so, I mean, I held on to this. I didn't even want to cut this, okay? It doesn't get any better, better than this. This is royal blue. You'll never, ever see this again. You're never, ever going to see any more of this. You're not going to get it. I didn't even want to turn loose of it, okay? I can't believe that we did this design. I can't believe that we did it for this price, but we did, okay? Mm -hmm. And I have to I tell you, I fought them tooth and nail on this. <laughs> I didn't want to let go of this. I did, did not want to let go of this material. Okay, this, it doesn't get any better than this. This is natural blue. This, this material, of the material that we got out of that mine, okay, this was all the super, super, super high grade that I squirreled away, that I kept away. I, it's just gonna, I was gonna save this for a rainy day so that maybe, you know, 10 years from now, I could release this and say, <laughs> okay, guys, for everybody who stayed with me for 36 years, right, this is your thing. So, um, but it came down to that. You'll never, ever see this again. This is a stupid price that we're doing in this at, even just at this price. I, I can get so much more for the rough. And this, this isn't treated, okay? This is the real deal. But this was like the top, not even 5%, you're talking the top 1% of this material that we got. And it took forever to collect this, to collect that grade. Um, and so, but, you know, for this necklace, I needed big pieces. Yes, yes. And these were the only big pieces I had. We had already committed to the order, so I went ahead and just said, okay. You know, I, I literally, I didn't want to do it. I wanted to cancel the order, but I would already committed. So here you go, okay? You're getting it. You, you know, it doesn't get any better than this, guys. I mean, this is incredible. I mean, this is something I have to tell you. There's nobody in my family, there's nobody that I know that I wouldn't buy that for and give them a gift. And to tell you the truth, I, I don't know anybody that would be disheartened or uh, be disappointed if they opened the package and got that. And you think it looks good there with what Adam is showing you? Wait till you get this material home and you actually open that box and see this. Shit. And here again, this, is, this isn't treated, okay? It's not it's nothing that's been color enhanced and nothing that we've done anything to. It's just that that was, okay, when you bring it in, you grade it all by size. 
Then you grade it by color, and then you grade it by grade. Okay, you know what this is? This has all three, size, grade, and color. This was the upper deck, the upper echelon of this material. Jay. That you can get all those center beads. That's all what they call royal blue jelly. It's a jelly, royal blue jelly opal. Jay, just for everybody ordering, obviously, as you can see, this will be sold out in moments. We do have the earrings available at $87. Um, add that to your purchase if you would like to. We have no others to go around. There's no other blue opal that we have in stock anywhere as much as we wish we did to so ask about the blue opal earrings. I, I'm, you know, it's a, 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 a delight and a thrill for me to spend this time with you, Jay. 26 years is a remarkable achievement. We're seeing some more of the backstory, some of the images, some of the history of this blue opal obviously it's why I chose to wear this sport coat tonight this and the uh, royal blue turquoise which is part two of this extravaganza words fail you in terms of looking at this seeing this uh, on a camera on the television you have to see this with the naked eye it is out of this world in every sense and it's not just the quality it's the size of it Jay, it's not like, hey, this is blue opal. It's here's a massive chunk or chunks of the finest blue opal, right? Well, and here again, okay, what it was is we had, I did the design. And again, I'm not saying that I used junk material or anything like this. I mean, the material that I originally designed with was a really nice uh, blue. It wasn't this royal blue, though. It wasn't that royal jelly blue. It was like a, a little bit lighter material that mm -hmm. I had. But I didn't have any big pieces. I did, you know, when we, we already took the order, uh, but we didn't have the big material. So here again, I was just, you know, we, we are, uh, you know, I'm a man of my word, and, you know, that our company, our, our integrity, we do what we say we're going to do. Um, the, and that's in the industry, when, when we buy, that's, that's why we got such a great reputation, to be honest with you. Um, you know, if we make a deal with you, that's the deal. There's no other deal. You know, you're going to get paid. We have a great, there's, I don't know anybody that has that has a negative thing to say about us, to be honest with you. And that's really hard to say, to be in business as long as we've been in business. And we're known for our integrity, known for what we do. So that's why we went ahead and we said, okay, we've just bit the bullet. I mean, I, I took the order. I knew I had to fill it. But I'm telling you right here, the, especially the, the center beads and the beads and the lar big, large freeform beads, that's where I had to pull out all stops and use this material. This material, I'm telling you, I mean, you're just not going to see it. Let's say it's the, this grade of material of all the material that we got out of that mine we mm -hmm. sh showed you earlier. And that that's not the opal mine. That's just where they find it. Right. That right. mine was it was either a tin mine or it was a nickel mine. And it's a seam opal. The local villagers mine this. They literally with a piece of rebar. They go. Now, we were getting this material and this this quality. But this is what we grade out, especially when it's that that color. I mean, that's the top one percent of the material that you get. So it's not like I could even do this again. And you know, I'm just telling you, this is the deal of the century. We had already priced it at the other price. Um, so, you know, um, we, we, we just went ahead and said, okay, we're go ahead and do it. Jay, but I mean, wow. <laughs> they're telling me? <laughs> this right here, uh, it, it's the deal of the century, guys, it, especially in an opal, and especially in an opal of this grade. We are, okay folks, do not hang up. We are counting you in. If you are on the phone, we are counting you in. So we have one for you. Oh my gosh. I have the final few if the earrings, if you are somebody that loves a suite of jewelry, loves a set of jewelry, the earrings are so well priced at $87.50. Um, certainly grab those while you can. We're gonna do two minutes or sell out. Sterling silver is what's touching your ear. Obviously for pierced ears, these, but you'll notice the faceting on the front once again, just brings them to life. It gives it the pizzazz, blue opal. You have to keep saying those two words, blue opal. As much as we love opal, blue opal is, I mean, Jay, it's again, an extraordinary opportunity for somebody that appreciates the finer things, right? Yeah, you know, and, and here again, this is like a royal blue. This is natural blue. I, I, I've done, okay, so blue opal in my whole career, 46 years. I've, I've found it four times in my life, four, okay? First time I ever got it was uh, the Peruvian material, Peruvian blue opal, the, Peru, uh, uh, the Peruvian pink opal and the blue opal came from the same, uh, the same mine, the same gentleman. Um, and um, then I had the blue opal material that we got out of, um, actually out of, of US. It came out of, 
uh, was on the Idaho-Oregon border, and it was actually being mined in Oregon. That sold out. Do you know I still have people call me, ask me if I'm ever going to bring that back? <laughs> and I, can't, I have to tell them, no. You know, that's one of those. It's gone. I mean, they, there is no more. You can't get it. Then um, there was another blue opal uh, that we got out of Africa, and um, that 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 was a, a blue material. Uh, we had a, a really good run on that for just a very for a brief time, and then this is the material from all from all places India, right? I never ever thought that I would be able to get this quality of opal, and it, this is a natural blue. Okay, this isn't dyed, it's not radiated, it's not enhanced, but here again, what you're looking at in this material, this was all the Jemmy grade material that normally even if you saw this this material is what you would see in you'd see it at 18 karat gold you'd see this in 22 karat gold you cer certainly wouldn't see it in earrings and you certainly wouldn't see it in that necklace um so but it is what it is and it, it is the opportunity uh, this is the buy of the century if you want if you want this material okay this isn't something i can repeat on it's not something i would repeat on um, like I said, we wanted to do something really special for our anniversary, and even the grade of the material I was using was, don't, don't get me wrong, it was like amazing, right? It was really upper grade. Mm. But when it came down to it, we had already committed for the show, and then once we started doing our inventory, we realized, oh my gosh, yeah, we do have a lot of the opal material, right. but we didn't have any in the size right. that we needed to cut this. Right. So. We just said, okay, well, that's what we got to do. <laughs> and this is, I mean, it's a huge, I mean, it's just a, it, but there, of, okay, of everything that we've had on this event so far, um, I'm not saying there aren't other deals that have been incredible deals, but really this is the deal of the century, guys, uh, the, the deal of the century. Um, I mean, I, like I said, I would buy that necklace, I would buy those earrings uh, for my wife, uh, for any of my mom, mm -hmm. my sisters, uh, any of my close friends, uh, anybody that I wanted to actually impress and know that what I gave them, they were really going to appreciate it or they, they were just going to go gaga over. And uh, I, that's what I would buy them. Okay. Well, you, uh, they can't, there's no way. You can't go wrong. And it is coming to an end. The necklace is completely sold out. So again, thank you for that. Last call on the earrings if you'd like to place your order. Uh, wow. Okay. Well, that's part one done. Um, Come on. All right. Before we reveal the price on this, let me just quickly set this up, folks. Jay has been here 26 years, and his signature stone is turquoise. It's what set his brand alight. It's what his fans, you, have always loved. For this 26th anniversary, and listen, even when this is sold out, I still got half an hour of great stuff, but I'm just telling you as it is. These two pieces were the ones that were meant to be the staples of the show. Folks, this is royal blue turquoise from high in the mountains in the clouds of Chile. This is the most expensive turquoise in Jay's collection, above and beyond Sleeping Beauty or Kingman or any of the other wonderful turquoises that you have seen. Jay brought this to HSN with an exclusivity nobody thought was possible. It was a color that rivaled those high blues, those robin's egg blues that we all desire and love. It was a color of turquoise that quite frankly would typically attract buyers to spend hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of dollars. This has been on HSN, I've presented it a couple times myself. To celebrate Jay's 26 year, really milestone, our team decided that for the final ever presentation on the network, they would lower the price to the lowest it has ever been, ever, to make not only it accessible to everybody watching, but also to really say thank you for making Jay's Mind Finds brand so popular here on HSN over all these years. Whether you've watched Jay with Colleen or Lynn, or well, quite frankly, any of our amazing jewelry hosts from Helen to Siobhan to everybody that you have seen over these 26 years, this is a gift to you. Let me grab it for a second. Let's go over here. This is a necklace that comes in at 18 inches, but goes to nearly 21 inches. I have surrounding pieces that you don't have to buy, but again, it's all in royal blue. 
If you're a collector of turquoise and you don't have royal in your collection, you gotta do it. It's a sin not to have this, you gotta have it. So let me put all these to the side for just a moment and do this. Folks, I have 1,400 available and they will be sold out. I'm wrong, I'm being told. She's telling me I'm wrong. Alison, what, what, is it less than that now? Okay. Okay, there's 11.90. Okay. A lot of folks have been pre-ordering is what I'm being told because a lot of you find it online. Okay, I think I've said enough. I've, 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 said, I, I've really built it up, right? And it needs it. It should be. It has to be. You've got to buy this because the price isn't $400 or $300 or $200. The price isn't even $149. Folks, for Jay's big celebration, the price of Jay's most expensive turquoise in his collection is coming in at $128.19. It's so low they marked it as clearance. That's how big a deal it is. The reviews are five star and five star and five star on hsn.com. Royal blue turquoise, not found anywhere else in America, but here on HSN as an HSN MindFind exclusive is coming to your home at its lowest price in history. 500 call, 600 call, no, okay. Nearly a thousand orders are coming through. Folks, if you would like it, we'll dive into the presentation, but I would encourage you. Okay, she, it, rather than me jumping in all the time, just keep your eye on what's left. These will be sold out in a moment. This is what I'll really quickly do, forgive me. Because you might want to get it at the same time. I have the inlay ring, it's $74. I'll quickly show you these. The inlay ring is $74 on special. Again, that's a, 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 a last time ever at that price. That is available in sizes five through 12. Five through 12 in the inlay ring. I wanna show you the inlay earrings. They're $83. Only 300 of the inlay earrings are available. I wanna show you, there's the item number of that one. Then the other one is gonna be the dangle earrings. They're only $61, is that right? Okay, they're only $61, again, all in royal blue. And then the other one that I've got is gonna be the stretch bracelet. The stretch bracelet is uh, an easy, easy one. That's coming in at $70. Jay, what a marvel this is to have royal blue at this price. How exciting are you about this? Well, I mean, okay, uh, you know, obviously, from the reaction, people get it. I mean, that's one thing about the mind find, you know, uh, viewers, the fans that, they, they understand this and they know that, I, okay, by far, this is, okay, the most expensive. Okay. <laughs> it's sold out. So, <laughs> so, guys, stay in the ordering right. process. We see you there. <laughs> we are counting you in. Jay, we'll keep talking for a few moments because I think we still have a few of the, the bracelet and earrings, I'm being told. So let me put that up. Well, I'll keep that here. Jay, keep talking about Royal Blue and I'll just show everybody okay. the bracelet but and the here's earrings. Here's the thing, okay. Of, of all the material that, that I have in my collection, when I say collection, I'm not talking about my specimen collection, okay? I'm talking about my collection of materials that I have that is productionable. So that it's turquoises that I have enough rough material that I can still do designs, okay? This is one of those. Um, I, I have the, we have the largest collection that I'm aware of, of productionable turquoises from around the world. We pride ourselves on collecting turquoise. Of all the turquoises I have, and I have Sleeping Beauty, I have Blue Basin, I have um, turquoise, I have Nakasari, I have, I have materials that, um, I have uh, red skin, old red skin. Um, materials, I, I don't have any Hubei, <laughs> but, <laughs> but I did it one time. But, this is the most expensive turquoise that I have in that collection. I paid more for this turquoise than any other turquoise ever, including Sleeping Beauty in my, my uh, history. Okay, mm -hmm. this is the most expensive. That being said, if you look at these prices that they're offering this at, they don't reflect that. And this was all the flats that we have. We have an exclusive. You can't go buy this material on the commercial market. There are a lot of people that want to buy this on the commercial market that would that actually would stand in line to buy it if I would release the rough, but we're not going to, okay? This was the first loads that we got out of the mine. 
These were all nugget flats, okay? So with the designs here, okay, these are the flats. This is what they, these are the natural flats. That's, that's how they look. Nothing's been done to that. These aren't even polished, right, guys. Right. We didn't even polish those. That's how this comes out of the ground. This is so hard. It's incredible. This is what everybody like just tries to gobble up. We're actually, all these designs that you're seeing don't even, don't even cover the material cost. I mean, I, they, they don't even, especially that, that necklace, that's ridiculous, that's stupid. I mean, you know, it was, it was, we were selling it below material cost because we needed to get the money back from the flats. Yeah. Now the material that we're getting out of it is bigger, it's wider. You wait till you see some of the uh, designs we're gonna be doing, but you're not gonna see designs like this. No. You're not gonna see, you're gonna see only cabochons. You've already started to see some of it, but people are just love it. This is even, to tell you the truth, I believe, okay, and this is really hard for me to say, I believe by far that it's not only the most expensive, it's probably the best quality overall of any turquoise that I've ever owned in my entire life, that I've ever had the privilege of. Wow. Now, I'm not saying I do have some Sleeping Beauty that is just like, I mean, more expensive than gold, okay? Right. I have some Blue Basin that I'm, you know, that is more expensive than gold, okay? that. It's literally the top 1%, um, maybe of, maybe even half percent of all the material that I bought over over the last, uh, say, 25 years that I still, you know, have in my in my production stash. Um, but this material right here, overall, for overall grade, everything that comes out of this mine, this by far is the the best overall grade material mm -hmm. that I've ever bought. It's incredible, and then hence the price. And the only reason that I paid what I'm paying for this is to keep everybody out, right? Right, right. If, if I didn't do that, other people would uh, be able to go in and get it. This is, I'm telling you, it's expensive, but it's worth the ride. It really is. If you really want a super high-grade turquoise and something... Now, I do have more of this material, and this is a great thing. So down the road, if you start collecting this, you're still going to be able to get it. Are you going to be able to get it at this price? No. Okay. But you're, you're going to still be able to add on to your collection until I no longer have this material. But I'm just telling you, this is really, for turquoise, like this is out of the park. Okay. It, um, I don't, you know, don't want to keep repeating myself, but literally, it's not only the most expensive overall general grade of turquoise that I've ever gotten in 46 years of doing this. I have to say, this is right there at the top of the heap. Well, we are 90 seconds or sell out, whichever happens first on the earrings and the bracelet. The earrings coming in at $61 and change. The bracelet at $70. We love the bracelet because it's hassle free. No issues with clasps. It's going to fit perfectly for you. It's a way to buy into the royal blue turquoise and to enjoy it and certainly get great dollar value on a clearance price, which is why so many hundreds of people have jumped in. If you would like the earrings, I have 75 now left. The earrings are great. You're gonna get so much use out of those because of the shape, because of the style, obviously. Um, I, can I just, I wanna just show you, can, do we have the necklace anywhere stood by? Guys, they are letting me know on the necklace. We're gonna grab the necklace for a second to show you. There are, in our system, we're seeing 250, which is just slow to catch up. But listen, if it's showing 250, it means there are 250 at this moment. If you missed out, go right now to order it. The necklace at 128 and 19 cents. Uh, it's item number 730411 for the Royal Blue Turquoise Necklace, the true, real showstopper of our show tonight to celebrate 26 years of J. King on HSN, but you must be fast. Order the necklace on FlexPay of $25, grab the bracelet and the earrings as well, you cannot go wrong. You can see why it gets the attention that it gets, the beauty that it gets. Thank you, Deke. Um, I wanna show our wonderful cameraman, Deke here, just managed to find it for us. If you're just tuning in, everybody went gaga for this. Fastest selling item I think I've ever seen with J. King, and rightly so, our system is showing 125 now left of the necklace, if you do want the necklace. I'm, listen, I'm always the first to tell you it's so frustrating when something sells out. So if there's even one available, I want you to know about it. Okay, so there's the necklace. You saw the bracelet, the earrings. Um, are we gonna show the ring? Okay, so, okay. 
Hardly any available, but we should show them to you for a moment or two. This is the ring and then the stud earrings. Uh, these are the inlay design. Again, ring is available sizes five through 12, but certainly ask your representative about what's available. Jay, real fast, just give us a, a minute on this. I love the design work in these two pieces. Okay, and this is old school. This is what they call cornrow inlay. So it's a three-dimensional uh, inlay. So it's not only the silver work, which is all hand done from sterling silver sheet material, but it's the quality of the turquoise, but it's actually the craftsmanship of the, of the turquoise. If you look at this, that's all what they call cornrow inlay. Very, very few people, you don't see that. That's actually, um, we learned that, you know, that's from my heritage, right? From the Southwest, that's where you see that. Um, and that's, you know, that's how our lapidaris learned it. You know, this was something kind of old school that Brian actually taught them how to do. Um, this isn't something that just even the lapidaris, uh, you, you have to actually be trained to do that. It's all three-dimensional inlay. So it's not a flat inlay. It's a three-dimensional inlay. So all of those pieces are individually hand cut and then they're pieced together that, like that, like a puzzle. So they, they have to make that all fit. And they all, do you see, there's no huge gaps and no. stuff in between that. You see how tight that is? That, that is because that's the quality of the work that our craftspeople can do and that our artists can do. The silver work's incredible. Here again, from sheet, sheet material, sheet silver, uh, silver. But, um, but look at the quality of the royal blue turquoise and then look at the quality of the inlay work. Uh, it, it really is truly a, a wearable art. It's art form. And you just don't see that. The only place you would see that is actually, and these aren't Native American, okay? Um, but they, uh, you would see this in real high-end Native American stores or galleries. Um, th that's where you would see the cornrow. Congratulations if you managed to get it. That was a fun 15 minutes right now. Jay and I celebrating in 26 years. Uh, still to come tonight, we're gonna talk about the jewelry vault. Also, Carol Brody joins us live from Greece. Jay and I have 19 more minutes to dazzle you with Jay's Mind Finds after this. My singular goal is to improve the quality of people's lives. Everything we do is intended to be unlike any other company of our kind. We just make exceptional vitamins so you could have exceptional health. It's not important that you get the products I'm offering, but it's very important that you get the information I'm sharing because information is the key to being a healthy person. At HSN, we love our crafters. So we're bringing you top-rated picks crafters love. I'm telling you this because your stuff is actually amazing. It was so easy to use. Plus, experts will share their top tips. We're going to make something really cute, really fun. We've got everything you need here for a full year of craft. Buckle up, buttercup. Join us on our next crafting event on HSN. Thank you for tuning in tonight with HSN and our big gem event. Jay King is here with his finale today of 26 amazing years on the network. We've still got more business, more wonderful things to present to you, more business to do with some special, special deals, which I think you're gonna really love. We wanna talk a bit about Spiny Oyster because there's a lot here. It's to do with Jay's heritage, his history. Um, Spiny Oyster, one of those organic gem materials. We were talking about amber earlier tonight and we talked pearls. Uh, Jay, I know it's uh, uh, always kind of, there's a lot of anguish around this because spiny oyster shell is so beautiful, so precious, so special. And if you could, you would do more of it, right? Well, you know, this spiny oyster, to tell you the truth, just like so many of my materials, it's, it's funny that you mentioned that. But um, yeah, I mean, it, it brings back memories. And this is, okay, I've shared this memory. So people that have heard this story that, you know, like, forgive me, okay? But, um, you know, this is one of, all, you know, all these materials that I show you, do you know that I get flashbacks? <laughs> so, <laughs> I mean, now, there are stories that I do tell. There's also stories I don't tell and I really can't tell. Now, Adam's heard some of them, but they're not, we, I can't tell them on air, okay? <laughs> they're real interesting, the okay? And yeah, and then some of them, to tell you the truth, 
you know, you think about it later and you go, wow, you know, I actually lived through that. You know, <laughs> it, at the time it wasn't so funny. Okay. But then after you, you know, then you're here and then you bring back, like I have flashbacks. Spiny oyster, every time I show spiny oyster, I get flashbacks. Okay, can you imagine me with hair down to my waist? Okay. <laughs> I'd love to um, see it. <laughs> okay, in a ponytail, cowboy boots, blue jeans, Hawaiian shirt, you know, like that was that was my official dress. Okay. I love it. And my Stetson hat, right? Okay, uh, even back then, okay, we would all pile in. We had a friend of mine, his name was George, he had this Volkswagen van. And we would all go down, we'd throw all of our dive gear, our tanks, and we would uh, take that van and we would go down to Wymas or to San Carlos, which is uh, on the Sea of Cortez on the western uh, side of Mexico. And we would literally live on the beach. You can do it. They won't let you do it anymore. Mm -hmm. But we would camp out there for, you know, a, you know, a week, two weeks. The only thing that we would go into town for is for, to get our tanks filled, our scuba tanks filled, and to get more beer or to, to uh, trade um, something, like maybe we'd, we'd shot, speared some fish or something or got some, you know, nice, you know, some nice fish, and we would trade that for shrimp or something like that. That's the only time we went into town. The rest of the time, and here's the deal, if we didn't spear fish or whatever or trade for shrimp, we didn't eat, right? <laughs> um, you know, of course we had beer, and that is nutritious, right? Of course. <laughs> so, and... and um, you know, how we discovered spiny oyster. Now, this is when I was first getting into the jewelry business. And this is when I first started to manufacture jewelry. As with all my friends that were in that van, we were all that, you know, we were doing jewelry. We were making jewelry that was part of, of how we were, you know, uh, we were going to school at the time. But we were also making jewelry and we had side businesses um, actually as manufacturers, not as salespeople. And so on the beach, down there, you would see these piles of spiny oyster. This looks, they should call it, they call it spiny, they should call it porcupine oyster. It's a natural oyster, it's delicious, um, but it has these spines. It'll draw blood, oh, wow. I mean, literally draw blood. If you just try to reach and pick it up for it, that's, you know, that's how it stays, uh, how it does. Um, the first thing you have to do, you always have to have gloves when you handle it, and then you have to knock the spines off, and you still then, you can still get cut with it. Now, what's happened with this, we, we used to, I can't even believe we used to do this. We used to fill this van, okay, with gunny sacks full of this oyster material, and it was free. It was on the beach, and we would take it up to America. If you tried to do that today, they, you would get arrested, okay? Literally, you would be arrested. Uh, not only in Mexico, they'd get you at the border. But back then, nobody knew about it. And so we were some of the first artists that actually started using this. And we were making it into beads. We were doing inlay. Um, but then all of a sudden we started going down there and then all of a sudden there's no piles anymore, right? And that's because they discovered that it could be made into jewelry and that started the whole boom. So I was in on this boom, uh, really, on the, uh, on the, really on the onset of when it, uh, when it started. Now this is protected. You only find it in the Sea of Cortez. Uh, highly, not just protected, highly protected. Um, you don't want to get caught with it. There's only about a dozen families that are grandfathered in that mm -hmm. can still um, dive for it, and they have two seasons. There's two seasons where they can actually dive and harvest this material. So right now, it's, it's really hard to get. Um, it's very expensive. It comes in these three colors. This is the orange. Uh, it also comes in a red, and it comes in a purple also. It's just beautiful, and I love that you've got them right there, Jay. It's great to see it. it they, 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 you know, they don't look real. They just look so special, so attractive. The, the necklace is the best seller of everything, just so you know. And again, this is a large, large pendant that's hanging down. Again, two different ways to wear this. Some of the matching pieces that may be... Uh, are attractive as well this evening to you are going to be obviously the cuff that I was sharing. Uh, there's so much there, so much quality. Again, all the silver that you're getting as well. 40 of those available before it's sold out. If you want the ring, there's 100 rings, sizes 5 through 12. So there's that fabulous ring, all sizes available there. And there's the earrings. Look at the earrings. Easy purchase at $94. 099-800, your item number. As we go back in history with Mr. J. King, when he had the long hair, the cowboy boots sleeping on the beach, this is where it all began when we talk spiny oyster. Okay, let's... Um,
let's just, can we just do a quick sellout? Let's, you know, because we're up and down. It's like a roller coaster ride tonight for every one of our bargain hunters, our uh, deal eagles out there that love, love, love a great catch. This is for you. Obviously, when it's gone, it's gone. There's no wait list, advanced order, extended delivery. This is beautiful amethyst and citrine, and it's a lot of it. I mean, look, let me quickly grab it up here. This is not teeny tiny, it's massive. This is on clearance at $66. Um, I love the colors together, the beautiful citrine and the amethyst. The earrings are gorgeous at $29. You would spend more money on fashion jewelry, on faux jewelry, on, uh, on plastic jewelry, quite frankly, that looks like amethyst or citrine. This is all real. I want to get a quantity update. Alison, how many of these are there? Yeah, okay, so there's only, th is that between the two of them? Okay, there's 327 total, 50 earrings, the rest of the necklace, I mean, obviously go for it. Grab it if you can, it's worth every single penny. Jay, we're just gonna spend a quick 90 seconds before this sells out. There's a lot of, would you call it value for money in these pieces? <laughs> okay, so anyway, this is my design. Uh, I love this combination. I do. It's, uh, so they're colored quartz, natural colored quartz. You've got uh, this beautiful Zambian amethyst, big crystals. I, I did the freeform. These are massive crystals, some of the biggest ever that you ever see. For, for Zambian material, like this is over the top, right? If you look at also the color on this, it's really a super, super high grade. Uh, uh, we took the natural crystals. We All we did is we just edge ground them. I did like natural freeform facets on them and it combined them with the natural citrine. So the citrine uh, comes out of a stope in uh, Brazil that I had this, I had those also, the natural big nuggets. I'd put these to size. There's, you know, there's a natural phenomena. It's very rare, it's called ametrine. Mm. And that was the inspiration for this. Now this isn't ametrine, it actually comes from two sources. I'm telling you, the purple from Zambia, the, the lighter color, the citrine, they're both semi-precious uh, colored quartzes. And they're really high grades. And this is the natural color, natural materials. I mean, that's just really, um, if you went and actually saw it from the ground, this is, and you pull it out of the ground and you just hit it really quick mm -hmm. and just did a light polish on it, knocked off the edges, this is what you're gonna see. Okay, this is the natural. I left it as natural as possible. My inspiration though was mother nature. Mm. And, my, and what I was trying to do is I was trying to mimic the ametry. That's what I was trying to mimic. It's one of my favorite uh, combinations I've done. I mean, you know, to be honest with you, in, in saying that, I'm, I'm not just saying that to sell it. I really don't care. I mean, I'm not even going to talk about the price because that's ridiculous. That's stupid. <laughs> so I'm just going to talk about the design, okay? I designed this, but I designed it for a reason, okay? I, You know, Mother Nature combines these two materials, and I just... Uh, was just trying to mimic what she does. I just love it as a natural color combination. I think it's just inspirational. It's one of the coolest looks in cool in uh, what I call colored quartzes that you can ever have. I mean, this combination of this citrine, this natural citrine, and this natural amethyst, it really, really um, is very, very special. It's very unique, and I really, I'm, I'm drawn to it. I'm very attracted to it. Thank you for all of your orders on this one. 091039, the earrings are gone, and I believe the necklace uh, is also about to sell out, so congratulations if you get that. We're gonna try and squeeze in as much as we can in Jay's final seven or eight minutes. In the last hour, we had a spectacular Malachite piece. It was around four or $500. A lot of you asked, do you have any other Malachite pieces at slightly less money? I have this, but I have hardly any of them. This is a beautiful multi-strand malachite necklace for 183. It's actually, there's a lot here, even with silver bead accents in there, you can see them glistening and sparkling. Love this. It's 18 inches, but it goes to around 21 inches. Um, the earrings are $71, the necklace is 183. Jay, we spent a lot of time talking about the inherent beauty and qualities of malachite and how its popularity continues to soar. This is again, extraordinary grade material. Now we're, we're under $184. Okay, you know what makes this, in, uh, okay, I just wanna explain this to everybody. Mm -hmm. Number one, this, this is Congolese, okay, this is specimen grade. Um, Malachi. It doesn't get any better than Specimen that. Specimen grade, okay. What's so crazy about this um, is my artist, and all honesty, like I said, we're manufacturers. Um, so, you know, when we're manufacturing, we're usually just really super busy. I mean, they, they really, 
um, when they come in, I mean, they've got their work, and that, that's why we're able to do what we do. Um, if we don't have any work for our lapidaris, which is, I mean, very seldom, right? But on occasion, this is what we have. Um, every lapidaris, maybe there might be four or five in a section, and they have what we call busy work, mm -hmm. busy projects, right? It's not a money maker, mm -hmm. but it keeps them busy when if we if they don't have something to do. And this is what I call busy work project. Right. Okay. <laughs> and, okay. So those small little amethyst, or little ma amethyst. I'm stuck on amethyst in my mind now. <laughs> malachite. Yes. Th this really super high grade malachite. Those are like the smaller pieces, and they'll just have those. They they hand facet those. Hand facet them on a diamond, a wet diamond lap wheel. Those are all hand facets. They do that with a pair of tweezers. A pair of tweezers. Wow. They'll sit there and they just facet those. They'll facet one side, they'll put it down, they'll pick it up, and they'll facet the other side. You can't, there's no way that you could pay for that. Just your labor factor in this <laughs> necklace is through the roof. We don't even include it. I mean, I don't even figure, I don't even figure materials or labor on that. It's just that, okay, I have it. Um, it but, you know, like these, it's not like I'm making 10,000 of them, guys, okay? Mm -hmm. uh, it would take a lifetime. You, right. uh, you know, right. like, even to do a few hundred of any of these in this size bead, that maybe took, that's maybe five years of production. It's crazy. Three years of production. It's not like we sit down and do that. If I did that in a, on a production basis, mm -hmm. you couldn't, you could not, you would, number one, you wouldn't like the price. Right. And number two, you, could, you couldn't actually make a living. Because, you know, you can make, what, you make like 300, what, in three years? I mean, you know, God, give me a break, you know? So, um, yeah, I mean, you know, th this these are really kind of unique things. I'm just giving you inside skinny. I mean, I probably don't, I didn't I didn't have to tell you that, but that's the, we love that's it. the reality of what we do, you know? That's the reality of it. Thank you for your orders on our Malachite. I hope you wear it in good health. I think you'll love it. Um, I just want to remind everybody about Labradorite. I'm stunned there's any of these left. Jay's Labradorite, his selections are just the best in my opinion. Premium quality, play of course, as you imagine with Labrador Essence. Um, some Labradorite, in fact, let me just move this over here so I can show you properly for a second. Uh, a lot of items sold out a little faster than we anticipated, so we have a few moments that we can share some other items that you may have missed. Sometimes with Labradorite, even when I'm on TV with you all, it, it, you know, you have to really sometimes work at it to show off all the amazing play of color. With Jay's Labradorite, that is not the case. I barely, well, I don't even have to move and you can start to see all the colors that are there. We have our Tanzanite available as well. We'll do our Tanzanite first and then we'll go to our Labradorite. This Tanzanite has the play of color, has that beauty that you'd imagine from all the beautiful blues and violets and purples that you've seen over the years. But Jay, whether you're looking at our Labradorite or our Tanzanite, there is certain grades and qualities that people aspire to and they want. And when it comes to both, you have delivered over time with these pieces. Well, you know, okay, on two, both of them, okay, the Labradorite, and here again, we still have Labradorite. The Tanzanite, um, that was it. I mean, we, we pulled it all together. Every every bit of tanzanite. Okay, the, I showed you my specimens earlier. That that's that really literally is the only rough I'll have left. That that's it. Every bit of tanzanite that I have now, um, we condensed two warehouses down to one warehouse. Wow. That one warehouse is now gone. Everything that was in there. So that means it's all over. Now, there might be some buckets stashed somewhere in there that I mean that are m mismarked or something. Um, and you know, there, we might find some later on. I'm not saying that that has happened. I'm, I'm not guaranteeing that that will happen. It'd be nice, but um, from everything that is on inventory, everything that we have, that we know that we have, um, it's all spoken for. It's already all in production right now. There is no leftover material. All the scrap material and everything is, that's, it's gone. So anyway, this has been so exciting. I love working with you, buddy. I mean, you know, um, it, we just have so much fun. We've been friends for a long time. Got a lot in common. I'm married to a, I'm married to a British um, wo a woman. You're married <laughs> to a beautiful American. So, you know, we've got, we got so much in common and so much to talk about.
Jay, it is a pleasure to spend your 26th anniversary with you. Truly, you're a superstar and we appreciate you. Sending all of our love to you, the family. We'll see you real soon here on HSN. Thank you, Jay. The amazing Jay King. More Mind Finds online at hsn.com. Search Jay King or Mind Finds. Coming up next, our final hour, we're opening the jewelry vault. Um, we are not only going to be showing off some extraordinary pieces from around the world, we're going to be visiting with Miss Carol Brody live in Greece. Oh, yes. There's a lot going on in this next hour. Okay. Let me... Um, let me 